Hey creeps, it's Cameron again and welcome back to my channel where I talk about books, movies, writing, and all things spooky. And happy September! We have finally made it. The Halloween season is upon us and I am very excited because I have a lot of stuff planned. On today's episode of Library Macabre, I'm going to be reviewing Bone Saw by Patrick Lacey. Bone Saw is an adult horror novel published by Perpetual Motion Machine Publishing. Before reading Bone Saw, I had never read a Patrick Lacey book before, so this is my very first one. And when it comes to describing the plot of Bone Saw, I'm not exactly sure how, to be honest. So I'm going to do something that I don't usually do when I'm reviewing a book. I'm going to read the synopsis for you. Liam Carpenter spends most of his time above his aunt's garage, watching obscure horror movies and drinking cheap beer. But this week is different. This week, things are getting weird. First, there's his favorite director, Clive Sherman, showing up in town unannounced. Then there's a string of murders that all seem like something out of Clive's popular Pigfoot movie monster franchise. Throw in Liam's mysterious new crush and the cough syrup addicted private investigator chasing her down and you've got his life as of late. And don't even get him started on she-demons and blood sacrifices. Bonesaw Studios is in town and they're bringing you the bloodiest sequel featuring a pig-human hybrid killing machine you've ever seen. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is Bonesaw by Patrick Lacey. As you can tell from the synopsis, there isn't anything quite like this. I've never read a book like this before. It is insane and I loved it. I'm gonna go right ahead and say that Patrick Lacey wastes no time. He gets right into things. He had a way of developing the characters and the setting in a way that did not break up the action and the gore at all. Patrick gives you everything you need to know about the characters and the setting, but he keeps the pace going. He doesn't break it up, not for a second. There is not a single page in Bone Saw that feels like filler or padding. It just keeps on going with the pace. It's like popcorn. You just want to keep eating. Simply put, it is just a roller coaster of a book that contains scenes that I did not think I was ever going to read and I didn't know I needed those scenes until I read them so good job Pat. As you can probably guess Bone Saw is bloody and gory and wears its love of 80s horror films on its sleeve. And on that note I will say that even though this book is bloody and gory there's definitely a lot of heart hidden in there as well. So with all that being said I definitely recommend picking up Bone Saw by Patrick Lacey. It is just a fun roller coaster ride of a book and I really thoroughly enjoyed it. So those are my thoughts on Bone Saw by Patrick Lacey, which also has a very cool cover, I must say. If you're interested in buying a copy of this book, I will post links down below in the graveyard. Thank you all so much for watching this video, and I will see you next time. Later, creeps.